So to wrap up, uh, we know that relative humidity indicates the chemically active water that's available to interact with adhesives and floor coverings. In our experience over the last 15, 20 years, making lots of measurements, thousands of measurements on, on many different floors, it really seems to be the most useful tool to understand the true moisture picture within a floor. Uh, adhesive and floor covering performance really does relate to relative humidity. As you saw, we can do tests, scientifically valid, accurate, useful tests in the laboratory that tell us how an adhesive and floor covering responds to different relative humidities so that manufacturers can set up these tiered systems and, and provide you with uh, particular adhesives and floor coverings that will work under different moisture conditions. We know that relative humidity can be measured usefully even when the building is not at service conditions. Uh, we will know in a fairly short time, um, we'll have available for you some graphs and some tables so you can convert relative humidity measurements made in the field uh, under whatever the temperature conditions happen to be to the true service conditions that the floor covering will see. And that's going to be great because it means we'll be able to make measurements early in the life of construction and predict if the floor will be dry enough when it's time to install the floor coverings or coatings.